welcome to Starlight Starbright 70. If this is your first time being here, thank you so much for watching. And if you're a returning uh, subscriber, thank you so much for coming back. Uh, today I'm going to be reviewing two paintings that I bought from Timu. Um, I purchased them with my own money, so this is not a sponsored video. Uh, but if you're new to Timu, <clears throat> I'm just going to explain a little bit what Timu is. It's an online marketplace that has thousands of different sellers. Uh, they give us shoppers lower prices as they cut out the middleman. If you are new to Timu and haven't downloaded the app, uh, I'll have a link in my description for you to use along with a promo code that will give you 30% off. So that will give you 30% off your first order, and then along with that, it, it will give you a $100 coupon to use towards your next order. Uh, just so you know though, you only have one hour to check out, so I would suggest you go onto a computer and just type in like timu.com and look at the products that they have. There's thousands. I mean, they have household, they have electronics, they have cards, they got jewelry, they got makeup. Um, they got cra lots of, uh, of crafts. I mean, I, most of my diamond paintings, uh, I have gotten off of Timu. So, um, my clothes, women's clothes today, I've got on my little heart and it's got a little paw at the bottom. Um, I've gotten that, uh, yeah, the pants, I mean, women's clothes, men's clothes, baby clothes, I mean, kids clothes, you name it, they got everything so like i said you only have an hour so check check out on the computer first uh i've had no issues with timu i've got many price adjustments and when i've had to do a return um i've had no issues with that i've gotten my money back plus usually i get to keep the product um i guess there are incidents incidences where they do ask you to return the item but it's all free so you just print out the shipping label and just return just make sure you keep your barcode um because you'll need that to return the item to them once they receive it i presume that you'll get your money back uh, the only reason why i've ever returned or asked for a return was either through shipping the item got broken or um, my diamond paintings have been like folded in half, like my bigger size ones. So I do suggest the diamond paintings that say you're gonna get two that are like one that is 40 by 70 and maybe you have like smaller ones at 30 by 40s. Um, make sure you have two or three that are, are 40 by 70s or make sure you just like maybe order all the same size. I mean, lately I've had no issues with ordering a couple of the bigger sizes, a couple of the smaller sizes. So uh, they've all come nicely, but I did order a really nice big one and it was more of the higher priced ones. And it was like totally folded in half. And so um, I took pictures of the damage and I submitted it and I got my money back. I ended up still, I was able to keep the painting and I did um, complete it after you know i laid it under my bed and or i should say under my mattress and flattened it out for a couple weeks and then i took an iron to it and uh, tried to iron it out the best that i could there was still a couple wrinkles on the back but you can't even tell now so um i will be reviewing some of my larger paintings that i've done and the paintings like i said have all come from timu so once i get that posted make sure you're subscribed so you can see those ones that i've completed but uh, if you like, if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. I would really appreciate it and uh, would love to hear your comments. So like I said, I am a new channel. So this is kind of like a learning curve for me. But, uh, but back to Timu. So like I said, I've, I've never really had any issues. I, I love Timu. Um, they've got great customer service. Uh, and the tracking, the tracking of your order is wonderful. I mean, it, it, right up to your door. So, and uh, secure payments. I've never have I've never had any issues with with my secure payments. So, shop Timu. I mean, I've been shopping since just, just since a year now, probably or just a bit over a year. And I started ordering last January, but uh, 
I'm a, I'm a Timu addict. Shh, don't tell anybody. So anyway, so let's get on to the paintings. Alrighty, so I got all the paintings set up, ready to go. Um, I picked out four of the of my paintings uh, that I have bought. Um, some of these I bought back in December. The two, the first two that I'll be showing, I got back in December, and then the other two I just pur purchased uh, January and then in February. So. So excited to show these I just love them um, so the first one I'm gonna show is oh first before that that it's like sitting right out in front of me is the kits so all these paintings come from the same company uh, the company is Centurwan I guess Cent Centurwan hopefully, hopefully I'm saying that right but this is the beautiful kit it comes in uh, it's like a uh, little cloth bag little pouch really really nice it's like a canvas kind of uh i can't think of like i was gonna say a potato sack <laughs> at least that's what uh, we used to or i used to call it call it but i know there's a there's a name for it so my apologies but uh but yeah so this is so this comes each painting that you you buy comes with the same so, so I have four nice little pouches, but, uh, so it comes with tweezers, which I don't really care for these. And the reason why they're not point, they're not very sharp, so they're not pointed. So it's very hard and flimsy. So when you try to pick up a diamond, it just, they just fly all over the place, but it does come with three, uh, pens. And then these are the multi-placers. So I presume it's three, six, and nine. It doesn't say on there. So that's what I'm presuming. And then of course it comes with the little scrunchies to go on the pens. I have a hard time getting these on. I don't know if these ones will be any easier. Oh, these ones just slid right on. So yeah, so. It's really nice to have these when you're using these kind of pens because they're extra cushion. So that's nice. Plenty of wax. So it comes in these little containers and then it definitely gives you enough wax. And then baggies. So if you need extra baggies. these All these paintings do come in their own bags, which is wonderful. Um, I do still put them in containers, but it sure is a lot easier than having to cut open uh, the other ones and pour them in and then get out other baggies to store the extras. So that's really, really nice. So yeah. So I'll just put that back in here. Close it up. A really nice drawstring. Just love it. I just love those. And then gonna move those for now and this is my first painting sunflowers it's got sunflowers and then it's got an orthodox church I I grew up knowing it as onion churches because of the top uh, steeples always look like onions so we used to have uh, I lived in a community um, my community personally wasn't but there were communities around that uh, were Ukrainian and uh, that's what it reminded me of so and then the fields with the sunflowers so this is the picture of it let's see if i can lift it up here a little bit so hopefully you can see oh, let me get that see it i know the lighting isn't the best i ended up having to film this at night um we ended up having a really bad uh sandstorm this afternoon the winds picked up and so it became really loud and uh just too loud to film but yeah so hopefully the lighting isn't going to be too bad in here but yeah so this is the canvas um stickiness oh lots of stick look at that it lifts it right up 
right off the table stickiness, which is lovely. All these paintings did come rolled up on one of those little uh, rollers, and which was nice. Uh, sorry, I was playing some music, and so I just turned it down. So I'm not sure if it was too loud. Uh, so this one comes from goes from one to nine, and then A to Z, and then the small uh, letters after the Z. This does have 40. So it's 40 colors. Thankfully, it doesn't have any symbols because that I have a really hard time sometimes reading the symbols. But you can see the drill fill really, really nice. Really nice. Nice and clear. You can see that. I always do use a light, a light pad when I dye and paint. I have two sizes. I have a bigger size. And then I have the 30 by 40 size but yeah absolutely beautiful so I think that's going to turn out really nice when it's done so each of the or at least this canvas anyway has is a 40 by 50 um, like I said it has 40 colors and includes four ABs uh, and the number of diamonds is 24,249 so this is just the colors of the, the diamonds. I'm not going to take them out of this bag, so I'm just going to leave them in. But yeah, you can see, really, really nice. Oh, I don't know if that's going to focus. There we go. Just the yellows and the oranges and the greens. And then some browns. Probably some blacks in there for the, for the middle of the sunflowers. Um, but I did, these are the ABs that came out of the bag, so I did take them out ahead of time just to make it a little bit easier, but really nice orange. Oh, you can just see the sparkle in that. Absolutely gorgeous. So we have a lighter orange and then we have a darker orange. Hopefully you can see that sparkle. Just beautiful. And then here's... A nice yellow so that will presume go in the sunflowers and I'm not sure where these ones will go this one's number 11 which is a B so I'll just see so yeah so this is gonna be scattered in with the leaves it looks like so in here there's some bees and then in here there's a couple bees so yeah those will be scattered in there and like I said the sevens are scattered in the sunflowers, um, 14, which is E. Let's see if I can find any E's. Yep, there are two scattered in the sunflowers. And the 28 is S. Hmm. Let's see where the S is. The S might be up here. Sorry about that. I'm going to see if I can find the S's in here. Oh yeah, so they are also scattered within. So all the sunflowers, anyway, and it looks a couple a couple places up here too, in the uh, church will have have the uh, the abs. So yeah, so I'm really happy with this one. Um, so this one, like I said, came from or they all came from that company. I will I'll put a link up. Uh, I'll also put a link in my description. But I'll put like the name on, on the screen, and then the price I paid for this one was fourteen eighty four. Uh, currently, it is discontinued though, so so I'm sorry. But yeah, this one got discontinued, which is funny because I just ordered it in December. So I don't know how companies sell out so fast and they just discontinue printing them, or what happens. Maybe another company will pick it up. I'm not sure. Um, this is the best company I found. On Timu, if you're looking for higher quality paintings, um, as you can see, it's it's a nice backing. This one, unfortunately, did get a little bit of a wrinkle in it. But what I'll do is I'll put the uh, placement paper on top of this here. And then I will take my little iron out and try to iron that crease out. But really, once you get the diamonds on, you probably won't even see that crease. So... I mean, here it looks, you can see that it's 
a little bit thicker but I think I have had them uh, pressed out under my mattress but but yeah that I think will have to be stretched and ironed out but I don't think that will be too much of, of an issue so yeah so that's the first one all right my next painting is some flowers again so like I said I picked out uh, I picked these paintings to show because uh, three of them I could use for uh, next month's event that Dharma Grandma has on for the uh, the petals. Um, well, let's see if I can get the proper name for you guys. Uh, sorry about that crinkling there. It is um, next month it will be All Petals 24. So any type of flower or plant. Of course, my favorite flower is the sunflower. Just absolutely love them. And uh, she is putting that on with Shelly's Real Life. So I will link both Diamond Grandma and Shelly's Real Life in my description. So uh, please go check their channel out. And uh, if you like diamond painting and want to enter enter a uh, an event, perfect so yeah so this is sunflowers this is a 50 by 50 um, this one is square uh, it's go has 38 colors and has four ABs and has 31,329 diamonds on it so yeah so if you can see that but yeah absolutely beautiful it does look like it's like in a stained glass kind of thing behind it so here's let's see if i can get that up there for you but yeah it's really really pretty uh this one ha uh goes from one to nine and then a to z all nicely in an order and then at the end it has ABD. So yeah, beautiful. These are the diamonds that came with it. Of course they all come nicely packaged and all nicely in their individual bags. And so here's some of the colors. You got the browns, the darker colors. It's a nice little, nice little green. And then this, look at that orange, just gorgeous. It's got, some, of course, the blues and the yellows and then the darker colors. And then another really nice orange. And then the ABs for this one are these ones here. So you have the pretty blue. You see the sparkle in that. And then this one here, just gorgeous. I love the ABs. They look so nice. I did a painting. It was a bear. And that one just had way too many ABs in it. And so anytime that the light shines on it, it just always sees a sparkle. <laughs> so. But here's the yellow. And then a ye lighter yellow. So I'm presuming that these are probably just going to be scattered through, through the painting. So yeah, so... There's a, there's a bunch of V's in here. Um, so that would be the, that would be this blue in here. And then, let's see where, if I can see any W's in here. Hmm. There's something on this painting. Hopefully that's not a hole in there. But one moment I want to check. Kind of rough on there. Oh no, I think that's just the way that looked like there's some tape or something on the outside of it. See if I can lay it flat again. Yeah, there we go. Oh well, I, I should have checked the uh, the rendering of this. Sorry, can't even see what I'm doing. But so stickiness, very nice. Lifts right off. Absolutely nice stickiness. That's one thing when you're working, especially with squares and your painting isn't that sticky. Oh, just to get them all lined up and stuck. But 
these ones have really really nice stickiness to them so yeah so that's the uh sunflower um this one i paid 14.84 uh right now it is sold out so uh, what i noticed with with the uh more expensive paintings on timu they get sold out really fast so then you have to wait and hopefully they'll come back um but what i can do is i will uh i'll put notify and if i notice that it does come back then i will let everyone know that it has come back I'm not exactly sure all the youtube -y things yet I'm still learning but i know there's some kind of a community channel that you can post things in so <clears throat> so as long as you're subscribed to me you'll get a notification hopefully for me saying that hey the painting's back so better grab it while you can um but yes i would really appreciate it if you would subscribe and like and send me a comment i know what you can comment about is the boats i have so many so many of the boats or the trays or whatever you want to call it um i have so many of them and i don't know what to do with them so if you have an idea or what i should do with them should i keep them or do you just throw them away give them away i don't know who would want them i know I, i've heard some people giving them away at schools but uh i guess i could try there i have at least or at least over 50 by now of the of the smaller trays and then uh quite a few of the bigger trays that i'm never you know probably never ever use and also the pens what do you you know what do you do with the pens that i i'm not sure but but anyway so let's get ready for the next one Alrighty, so the next one this one's a bigger one uh, she is 55 by 75. Man, I don't even think I can get her all into the frame of the camera. She's so big. But yeah, just absolutely gorgeous. It's a moon. She looks like she's wearing a wedding dress. This lady does. Absolutely beautiful. This one is a 55 by 75. Um, let me just see. She is, oh, she's discontinued. How sad. She's just absolutely gorgeous. Hopefully some other company will pick her up or, or uh, maybe they'll bring her back. I'm not sure. But, and I just ordered her, like I said, probably like a month ago. But she got the moon. I have another lady like this um, that I completed, and uh, that's a painting that like I was saying that came all damaged. But this one came really, really nice. Um, this one, like I said, has 44 colors. Um, again, 1 through 9, and then A to Z, and then, and then the rest of them is the small letters. So all in order, which is wonderful. Uh, this one, as you can see, will have nice color blocking in it and the, the rendering I'm sure is just really really absolutely nice in this they all do I've, I've never had problems with the rendering of these paintings and you, and the stickiness has always been really really good you saw with the last two it was really really nice but we'll we'll check and see I'll see now this one's not as Oh yeah, so there is there are some areas that aren't as sticky, but so might be a little bit harder. This one is a round, so it's not square, so it might not be as bad, but hopefully not. You see, it has some air bubbles in it. So what I usually do though is when I get these paintings, is um, I'll flatten them out under my mattress and then I will go and I'll put the uh the papers on them and that seems to keep them really nice and straight and uh the diamond painting uh ones I got for the just the white ones I get from Timu 
So very, very nice. The colors of this one, as you can see, you got darker, you got the greens, you got the, the darker color again, and the greens, and some grays. Oh, look at the beautiful blues. So, yeah. Really, really nice. All these uh, packages do come with a code on them. So this this number here, if you can see it, hopefully it focuses. There we go. So this number coincides with the with the painting, which is really really nice because I store my my drills separately from where my paintings are. And then this one as well came with four ABs. Um, this one, I'm not sure if I said, had 43,896 diamonds. <laughs> so yeah, and this is a 55 by 75. So really nice white. See if I can focus. There we go. And then pink. Pretty and pink. Really, really nice. And I presume it's probably going to get scattered out in her... And her dress are probably the flowers up there but uh, let me see so this one is 17 so it's H Let's see if I can find any H's on her. oh yeah here in her dress there's some H's so yeah they're just gonna be scattered which is really nice I like the scattered ones and then the blue one is small E so, yep, that's going to be in her dress here. It's a bunch of small E's. So, and the white one is P's. So, again, see all in here is P's. So, it's going to go up into the moon. The other uh, painting that I did, which was very similar to this one, um, I will uh, be showing in... A video when I do my largest size paintings that I haven't uh, posted yet on, on uh, YouTube um, my other ones I have like a small and then kind of like a medium to large I guess 40 by or 30 by 40s I wouldn't call you know uh, really I didn't know what to call it I just said medium and then I posted some uh, 50 by 50 and, and bigger in another video so um, so yeah, so, so please feel free to go back and watch those, give them a like, and, uh, again, please make sure, uh, you hit that subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. I, uh, I'm looking forward to, to showing more paintings, uh, that I've purchased and, um, especially the ones that I've completed. I like showing that. But again, here's, here she is. Look at those flowers. Just absolutely gorgeous. This one's going to be so pretty when she's done so yeah I look forward I guess I could do that one for next month too but I think this one might take a while to to complete so so on to the next one all right so for the very last one I for today that I want to show you is um <laughs> this one's a pretty big size it is a 50 by 88. Again, you can get all these paintings out. Well, sorry, some most of them are sold out or discontinued. But uh, they do have paintings this size on Timu. Um, like I said, this company I really like just because of the canvas. It is, like you can see, it's flocked. And then it has the nice ribbon sides to it. So, very, very nice. And the, the rendering of these paintings are really nice. So, are you guys ready? Let's see if I can flip him over. <laughs> and there he is. Beautiful wolf. Just love him. Absolutely gorgeous. Look at the eyes on him. And the nose, so pronounced. I'm sure he'll look really, really nice when completed. I have no doubt. So yeah, just beautiful. Sorry if there's a bit of a glare. 
but this one has 45 colors like i said it's a 50 by 88 um it is this this one i believe is a round as well maybe not no i think this one is a square sorry this one is a square i think the only one that i got round was the lady so let's just check to see how the uh all the canvases make sure it's nice and sticky oh yeah right very nice that's one thing about this company most of their paintings as i said are really nice and sticky and you definitely want that when you're you're doing make especially for the squares um i mean when you're doing rounds too but i noticed with the squares it sure helps when that's nice and sticky then they're not moving all over the place um, but this one again too, one to nine, and then it has right down to Z. I don't know if you can see that. But here's the, the chart. So yeah. And this these paintings are nice too because they have a chart here at the bottom of the painting, and then they also have one here at the top, which is really, really nice. Also, I like it that all the uh paintings are already in bags just makes it a lot easier so these are the colors kind of scattered all all around because i picked out the ab's ahead of time so but yeah those are all the colors the nice whites and the browns a bit of blues some pinks a lot of gray and the and a really nice purple look at that purple and then or just blues so yeah and really for for being squares I think these squares actually look really nice I don't know if you can see that in the packages but maybe when I show off the ABs you can see them better so the ABs are let's just lay them out here so the first one here is a really nice pink pretty pretty in pink but yeah, I mean, they, let's see if I can, but you can kind of see, they all look really, really, really nice. I mean, I really don't know what, what other companies have for their squares. Um, mo like I said, most of my paintings, at least all my square paintings have come from Timu. So I just started dyeing painting. Uh, like I said, I think, oh, I don't even know if I said this before, but I just started dyeing painting in July, June or July. I think it was June or July anyway of, uh, last year. So, and this is, look at that blue, just gorgeous. And then a few of these blues. So I presume these ones will just be scattered around. And then the light blue. So this painting well, as you can tell, probably have a lot of a lot of blues in them, which is really, really nice. So yeah, I'm really looking forward to working on this one. I'd probably cut it up already if I if I didn't have the uh next event planned that I want to do for uh Diamond Grandma. But yeah. And I don't know if you can see him. I don't know if he's better if you can see him over the plastic or. But yeah, that kind of be when he's done. Really pretty. He's just gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Again, uh, the bag, this bag too, coincides with this painting with the uh, barcode, which is nice. So um, very easy to, to find them, find the drills. I know I've had other paintings that didn't have any codes and I didn't write it down because I didn't notice and uh, had a heck of a time trying to figure out, oh, is this the right colors or, you know, luckily, I mean, they came in, they come in uh, a row of, say, just say 24 and then some of them are 22. So that's kind of how I figured out which diamonds they were. So, but yes, but I just want to say thank you so much for joining me in uh my first diamond painting review i don't know if this is called a review or if it's called i i guess in a, in a way this is my first diamond painting review of uh diamond paintings i have purchased off of timu um 
Again, I will link my uh, affiliate code and my promo code for those of you that have not downloaded uh, Timu on your phone. <clears throat> uh, please do. It's uh, well worth it. Especially if you love diamond painting. The prices of their diamond paintings are so... Um, I don't want to say cheap, but uh, so well affordable is probably the right word to say. Very, very affordable. Especially for these for these big diamonds. I mean, I've been on other sites and for, or for these big paintings. And the prices for some of these can be like as high as in the uh, 50s to 80s. So, and this one here cost me $22.87. Yeah, really, really good price, I'd say, for the size of a painting. And just, I mean, the rendering of it is just really, really nice. This one, too, though, just does have a couple folds in it, which I'll, you know, iron out, and it will be fine. You won't even notice. So, absolutely gorgeous. Um, unfortunately, this one is sold out. So, hopefully, they'll bring it back. Uh, like I said but, uh, previously, I will put up the company's name. Uh, and unfortunately, I, I don't think I have much to, to link for these paintings in my description. So I will hit the notification. If they do come back up, I'll, I'll let you know. So please subscribe and hit that thumbs up. So you can see my thumbs. Hit that thumbs up. And uh, I would love to hear from you. So you can just uh, shoot me a comment. And let me know what you think of these paintings. If uh, if you like them. Or where is your favorite place to purchase paintings? Like I said, I'm pretty new to all this. And I've really only purchased from Timu. Uh, and so far, like I said, I've, I've been satisfied with... Uh, the diamond paintings but i haven't tried any um of the more expensive kits if there are any better I, I i don't know i think what i mean it's once they're complete i just it's just they just look beautiful that's all i gotta say you have yourselves a wonderful night um or day afternoon morning <laughs> depends where you are and uh Blessings and much love. Thank you so much for watching.